today. Welcome. Welcome. Hello, guys. We're, we have Eli with us again today. I'm our smarty mum. Yeah. And we are going to continue with our work for doing some paint plumbing for Pride. Yeah. Now, I'm going to be doing the rainbow piece I told you about. Yeah. Uh, Eli is going to be playing around showing you what kids can do with these that we made. Yeah, easily. He made a rainbow piece, he may decide to do something completely different, it's up to him. Uh, yeah, you, um, it's just you're making easy things like you, we did in the last episode and you Wait, just got yep. crazy with the paint. So well, we've, well, we're not going to go crazy with the paints. Uh, you can just do every, any colour you want, you, it doesn't matter which order it is. Right, Eli's also going to let Mummy explain what we're doing. So, in Time for Pride, Mummy is... I am going to make this, which I will show you pictures at the end of the video of our finished set work. What mine I'm going to put, do a painting on top of for disability awareness. Eli's, he, we are going to put a print on top of, uh, words on, and put up on my red ruler page, aren't we? Yep. So, Eli, what colour are you starting with? Oh, let me see. I'm going to start with the green, I right. think. Carefully, remember we're not pouring very slowly. Now, paint pouring is just a bit of fun, so we're just going to have a bit of fun with it. Now, I'm starting with red, as I said, I'm doing purposely rainbow art. I'm just putting my mainly in the middle. I want, oh, I wanted that colour. Red? But I'll go for yellow. Then. Now, if you put it in next year, I want you, well, I want you to pass them back over here so you don't knock them as you reach yellow, over. Please. So, great. I'm using some orange. Careful how much you pour on. These are still quite nice and runny. The beauty about pouring paints I'm just and acrylic my... paints is how they go I'm into just each other. Please don't talk Please. over me while we're doing the video, otherwise, they won't be able to hear you. So, wait till Mummy's finished talking and then you can talk. Okay? So, tell them what you're doing. So, I'm just doing random dots um, just so it can spread out all it likes. Very cool. Now I'm swirling with mine as you can see. So mine's happening a bit differently. And as I said, these are using the paints you saw us make in the last video. They're pouring really nicely. And they are purposely made using that glue. So they... And acrylic has this beautiful property of pouring like this. And if you make make it in this way, you can make such beautiful pictures. And it I'm doesn't gonna... blend with each other. It just creates wonderful patterns. And I think that's kind of amazing. So I need, obviously, since I'm doing the rainbow for Pride, I need to add a few different colours of the rainbow. Now, Eli is doing a really cool spotty pattern. I'm going to move some of these just so they get a bit further out of shot. Remember, we need to save some for the other art, Eli, so be careful how much you're using these. Now, your spots are looking rather cool, Eli, over there. Aren't they now? Yep. Can I have that, that please? Oh, of course you can. And then I need a purple. And dark blue. And I... I think I'm done with mine. Are you ready to do the lifting it up and see where it goes? Yep. I, plus, plus mine is a bit random. It can go like anywhere it wants. It really could. That one could. So that's one of the beautiful things about these. Now I've got every colour of the rainbow on. I do want a bit of white to separate those colours out a little bit because it does some really cool effects by having some white in and amongst those. Yeah, like mine. I've done it with like... Um, Heads, but but just in dots, and I put a bit of white on my. Now, so we're going to pour, but we're going to pour towards them. So even if you want to change your sides, change it and then pour towards the camera, so they can see what's happening as you do it towards the camera. So let me let me, let me help you like that. I know you struggle with paint on you, don't you? It's pen in foot paint, but it's a lot of fun. So pour it towards the camera. So tilt it that way, and then we turn it round. And we tilt it that way, so they can see what's happening. But I'm going to stop there because... Do you want me to do yours, Eli, the pouring bit? No, no, thank you. Thank you. I just need to... Now, Eli's Asperger's means he really struggles with paint and things and that messy on his hands, so he's doing really, really well today to get paint. But messy, isn't he? To be on YouTube helping me, so really proud of him. 
because getting stuff on his hands has been a big issue for him since he was little. He struggles to have any mess or anything sticky on his hands whatsoever, don't you? Yeah. So as you see, I'm just tilting it to the side. But he was desperate to be on this YouTube channel to do this, knowing that paint would be on your hands, didn't you? And you still wanted to do it. That is looking wonderful, Eli. Get the towel. The towel will do it quicker for him. You are doing amazing. Do you want me to finish the last little bit? Let's get it to the side no, for you. thank you. I don't know. You're so. determined, little boy. Let's, I'll tell you what will help. I'm going to pour you a little bit more dark blue there. And it'll pour quickly to finish that last little bit off. Watch. I think I'm going to stop there. There you go. But that is an absolutely stunning piece of art, Eli. I actually really like that. So... We're going to do the same now, we're just going to do it with but small But we're going to show them a trick first. Yep, and we're going to do, we just do oil on it. And if but I've do left the, have I left the dripper in here? Um, um, I don't think, no. No, yeah. can you see it? This is what happens with a... Yeah, yeah. Where? If, if you do tiny bits of it, you can make funnel. Or you, if you want, you can do big ones. Uh, it, uh, and it just makes a very nice effect, but when it finishes, it, it's a Since beautiful Since I can't find my dripper, eye. we're going to use this, so Mummy's going to put it on the eyes. But we're going to do little drips, and this is a way to make ourselves... A beautiful pattern at the end, yep. when it's all dry. We wipe the oil off. And since we are doing it this way, the cheap way, cheap way of making cells, it works. All the same. All the same if you did it with another one. We make just as just as beautiful cells. We just make it our way. You have to tell me where you want yours, and I'll do it for you, Eli. Because dark blue. You want some on the dark blue? Yeah, on the dark blue. Please, I want some on my green. Oh, you've already booked right? On my yellow. On my orange. On your orange. And on my purple. And on my turquoise deep colour. It's really, I don't know how that's colour made. It's, got it's the green and the yellow mixed. A turquoise. I you made your turquoise. I made the turquoise myself. There we go, that's yours done. Yeah, so now we're going to let that settle. And yeah. while that's settling, we're going to make. We have a couple of really tiny canvases. Now, I, I've picked a certain kind of canvas here that are really cheap. If you look at the back of them, yeah. they are stretched canvases. Now, that's because if you do this kind of pour work on boards, if you unless you get more expensive ones, they can warp. These, though, you can get really cheap packets of like 10 of them from Amazon just to play around with. You get like 10 for a tenner. And... They're really good fun, but make sure you're getting a stretch variety, otherwise they'll warp as you do your work, unless you get the bigger sizes of them. So I think I'm only going to do two, because this one's a smaller one, so I think I'm only going to do two colours on mine. Two different colours, that's fair enough. Whereas I think I, I'm not sure yet, I'm going to go do a bit of purple, I think, starting down the middle. I'm going to do a wave of it. I can I um, Let me get this help you out, cause you can't. Me and that, I'll fix that for you. Oh, let's clear the room and then fix you your yellow. Uh, so let's. I am really struggling with this, but I am still doing it. You are. You're doing phenomenally well. Yeah, so there's I'm your room. I'm actually quite struggling with a bit. Of... I you don't do well at all with any mess on you, do you? I don't. I, I am absolutely just... I've got a dot down there. So I am doing a traditional like kind of swirl effect in the middle. That's cool, Eli. And then I'm going to add some red, I'm just bright red doing there. like some sunny colours, like actually... Oh, you learned what they've meant before, aren't you? Warm colours. Yeah, no, actually, I'm going to do like, um, you know... The solar eclipse that was happening, gonna happen today. I'm well, it did happen today, you just unfortunately didn't get to see it, did you? Yeah, uh, uh, so I'm gonna do them kind of colours. Yeah, we had a so, solar so eclipse today, which Eli is a space nut, aren't you? 
Yeah, but I didn't get to see it. No, we had cloud cover, but... I didn't get to see it. I know you didn't. Now, I'm just going to have to... You know, just have to... Do you want me to do this one, Eli? No, thank you. Are you sure? Yes, I am. Okay. So, so then... got to hook your fingers underneath on the board, like that. No, yeah. If you hook your fingers on the board... There we go. Ooh, running nicely. Beautiful. I'm really bad at it. I'm really struggling with this. I can see that. But I'm doing well. You're doing exceptionally well. It's, and it's looking superb. Look at that. <laughs> so, we can again add uh, oil to it if we want to, but I'm actually liking mine as it is this time. This... I love that pattern. Now, I'm not sure about Eli. You like my own oil on his? I am liking it, but I do just do want a bit of That's oil fine. on mine. You can help want cell, cells on yours. You can have cells on yours, my dear. So, Eli? I only want like two on mine. I only want orange on the orange I will yellow. try and only make two, but I cannot promise because this does not always drop the way you want. Oh, 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 just on the orange and yellow, that's all I want it on. On the orange and yellow, like that? Yeah. That no. Yeah. And there we go. So this is how it turns out and we will I will put a final pictures of how these are once they're fully settled at the end of our video. But this is really good fun and really good fun to do with kids. And and I'm very exciting. And very exciting as well because they get to make something that looks truly amazing at the end of the video. I'm sure you can see. And they can be really proud of. So I am very proud of mine. I'm very proud of yours too. So I hope you did enjoy watching this. I actually like that one the best. I think that's my favourite one of mine today, but I actually like your little square too. I think that's my favourite. I but no, that's my favourite of yours. Why? I like that one. Why? I just like the colours in it. I like how it made worked. Yeah. So I I'm gonna give you a high five. High five! And this has been I've been nice to my mum and he has been Eli. Eli, and we are going to say we hope you have a good day. Yeah, we are going to do the rocks next episode. We are, so stay safe and well, guys. Bye.